Optional strings might contain a string like hello, or they might be nil, nothing at all. Consider this optional string. Var name string question mark equals nil. What happens if we use name.count? A real string has a count property that stores how many letters it has. But this is nil. It's empty memory, not a string, so it doesn't have a count. Because of this, trying to read name.count is unsafe and Swift won't allow it. Instead, we must look inside the optional and see what's there, a process known as unwrapping. A common way of unwrapping optionals is with if let syntax, which unwraps with a condition. If there was a value inside the optional, then you can use it. But if there wasn't, the condition fails. For example, if let unwrapped equals name, print unwrapped.count letters, else print missing name, end the condition. If name holds a string, it'll be put inside unwrapped as a regular string, and we can read its count property inside the condition. Alternatively, if name is empty, the else code will be run.